The Plata State House of Assembly has confirmed the suspension of the chairman of Kanem and uh, Kupan local government areas. Chairman House Committee on Information, Philip Dasson, says the House took the decision following the non-payment of allowances of some of the councillors attached to their local councils. He said the House had tried to interface and directed the suspended chairman to pay up monies being owed to those involved, a directive which was disobeyed by the chairman. There were troubles that came up between the executive and the legislative at their various local government levels that has to do with them suspending their councillors and their inability to pay some of their entitlements. The House invited them to the executive session, discuss with them, they agreed that they were going to keep to the directives. Today we got communication from both of them, not keeping to the directives as they have agreed to do. So it immediately sparked off the interest of the members of the Land Assembly and the gather was heated on them. They are now on three months suspension. Politics being the way it is, people can insinuate what is in their mind. Ordinarily some people will say that it's because he is contesting for the seat of the Senate in the southern zone here. But the fact still remains, that position can be contested by anybody. He's most qualified, he's the son of the zone, he can go in for the contest. But what is happening now is has, is having no relationship with, with his contest. The truth still remains, he has not kept to the rules that were given to him.